Hi everyone, I'm George, I'm from the UK, and my story is about this watch, the Tag Heuer Formula One CAH1113. Now, I first noticed this watch when I was around 12 years old, so about 12 years ago now. And I was going on holiday with my parents, and before the flight, we were just having a look around the shops in the airport, the various watch shops and other bits, and uh, I saw this watch, and I remember just being totally blown away by it. It was unlike anything I'd ever seen before. The sort of bright orange dial, the black plastic bezel, the stainless steel bracelet. I thought it was just absolutely beautiful. And then I saw the price. It was around about, at that time it was somewhere between 900 and 1,000 pounds. So obviously way beyond my budget as a 12 year old. I remember saying to my dad, please can I have it? Please. I remember, I think I tried to make some crazy deal like, be my birthday and Christmas present for the next five years or something stupid like that and uh, my dad who's not into watches at all had a look at it and it's like what? no of course you can't have that it's insane I'm not buying you that I'm what 12 year old can't have a watch like that it's ridiculous so in the end I left without the watch but I never forgot it and uh, I managed to find a picture of it which I'd look at occasionally and whenever I passed the watch shop I'd always have a look in the window to see if I could see it. So fast forward around six years after that, I was 18, had my first job, and uh, I still wanted to watch, I still remembered it. But by that time, Tag Heuer no longer produced it. So I had to try and track it down another way from an authorised retailer or going to a shop, because that's the only way at the time I knew of to get a watch. So I eventually tracked it down and found it for sale online and I bought it. It's a pre-owned model and uh, I remember that feeling of when I first got it, took it out of the box and put it on my wrist. It just felt amazing. It was that feeling of accomplishment and achievement and you know coming to the end of a six year wait for this watch. And uh, the high I got when I put that on my wrist, I haven't experienced with any other watch I've bought since. I've been lucky enough to buy a few and uh, this isn't particularly interesting horologically speaking, it's a quartz watch, you know, very simple, but the high I felt, as I said, it just hasn't been matched. And it, I think that's because it was the start for me as well, it was definitely the start of an obsession, and really, I've never looked back.